I think that computers are really hard to talk about. And that's why you don't teach computers in computer class because um, computers are too big. And so um, you can't have a teacher teach computers. You have to learn it from a book. Um, and but, but you do need a teacher to teach you computers. And so um, I don't want to talk about computers anymore. Uh, I feel like a lot of people don't want to talk about Donald Trump. <clears throat> And let's face it, okay, did they impeach him because I said he was an agent of a foreign power? Probably. Um, is he? Probably. Um, am I an agent of foreign powers because I have relationships with foreign governments? Yeah, I feel like I don't even understand my relationships, but um, I do a little bit. It's just... Um, it's really confusing. Um, yeah, so I take things wrong a lot. And all mistakes are made for a reason. So anyways, what I'm trying to say is, so Donald Trump fires this ambassador. Why? Because the president's job involves firing and hiring ambassadors. It's in the Constitution. So, um, that's his job, and Ukraine didn't want her, and it's like, you don't want this person? Here's a new person. Um, but, honestly, I don't fully understand the situation, and let's face it, do I fully understand a lot of situations? Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't understand a lot of situations, like Offset. Um, I don't understand, like... I feel like what they're doing is they're trying to go after everyone that has a gun, but I don't know. I don't understand. Anyways, so Donald Trump fires an ambassador because that's what a president's job is. But you have to think about Donald Trump's perspective, which was very, very, very um, concerned about foreign currency transactions, which do we do foreign currency transactions to help people like um, – buying a lot of chocolate that we don't eat stuff like that because it's like all right i do like you guys i want to be able to do business with you yeah we do and that's just reality of um, the world and chocolate's not super duper perishable and i honestly have a very 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 strong mexico addiction um it's just because mexico grows avocados so uh it's kind of hard not to have um it's kind of hard not to, it's, it's kind of hard to be a good person nowadays and be like, oh, I'm going to eat locally. Gosh, in Texas? All right, so, um, what are we talking about? Uh, what, what are physics? Physics is something with the world doing forces. It's the forces, right? I don't know what physics is. I don't even know what physics, I feel like, I feel like I'm, like, I feel like physics has gotten to the point that it's just like, hey, uh, do physics. And it's like, all right, do you mean like do crazy engineering that's like 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 a, a, an incredible feat of engineering with a massive team of experts yeah that that's all right so anyways um yeah how big of a hack did i just catch with the wep thing and I, it's crazy that 802.1x is such a powerful um what is it called specification all right so um let's think here all right computers are hard talking about donald trump's hard and um i don't know the situation but i do know that donald trump was concerned with foreign currency and congress was giving tons of money to ukraine and he was like all right i'm trying to look i'm trying to find places to cut corners with my foreign currency tra currency transactions because like, I, I actually do understand where John, John Alexander is coming from because remember, he used to like call, like there are stories about him calling Michael Flynn at like two o'clock in the morning. Do I want my currency to be strong or do I want my currency to be weak? And then I told Donald Trump, I was like, your currency needs to be stable and that's the key to it. Um, but um, that doesn't mean that you don't want to um, not, you don't want to give your... Do you want to give your money straight to Russia? 
basically. Um, because that's what happens when you give it to Ukraine, no matter what, basically, because um, of currency pegging. And, uh, okay, so now all these computer people are like, I'm from England, and I'm part of this group of people that you're mad at, and you made us mad when you talked about Capital Group. And um, they do American funds, but they're uh, Capital Groups in, in California. All right, now that I'm confused about which... I'm con confused about who's who still. But, um, okay, so England, though. All right. All these bankers have spied on me forever, and they have learned one thing. Ha! What, bitch? You think I give a fuck if you spy on me? Oh, spy on me. See what happens. See what happens to this. And then what happens is <laughs> I screw you if you spy on me, and it's kind of my thing. Because I know I'm getting spied on, and it's like, I know I'm getting massively spied on, and um, before I didn't know anything about computers, and then now I know about computers, and then I think I'm losing, but then, like, unbelievable how good I'm doing at defense, because defense is easy, especially when you have it on the physical layer, pretty much. Alright, so, um, but I'm, I'm still losing, let's face it, they, they, cyber security, they, they, they hacked the crap out of me. And I don't, I don't know what their capabilities are. And they've, I feel like I'm always, always losing. And that's why I, I, I feel like it's, it's, it's really crazy how VMware is that good. Because you can just, but the other good thing about VMware is, I, I think it does do its own DHCP and DNS. Maybe DNS. I don't know. All right, so what are we talking about? why I need to behave myself and try to be president when I might just want to be a professor introduction to cybersecurity at Stanford and everyone will already know more than me or I could teach grad level class on cybersecurity and then everyone would know more than me and then every time I'm like eh, what's that thing with the computer that's the thing and then everyone will be like I know what it is, and then I'll be like, oh gosh, you guys all know more than me, but somehow I'm teaching you because it makes you all talk to each other, but then I don't really, but maybe I, it's because I have so much experience with hacking, but then it's like, I can't get a job because I don't have a certification, but I've caught more hackers in a week than a lot of people catch for a lot of their career, um, but I don't know, maybe not, maybe not. Because I, I, I do have false positives a lot. Uh, but false positives are okay as long as you have backups. And that's why it's nice to have a server. And I feel like what happened is Google Chrome's encryption was that good. But then it's like, I don't know what's happening on the application layer with their encryption. It's all called TLS to me. But um, I, I feel like it, it really does make a difference. And that's probably why Microsoft switched over. But I'm not 100% sure if that's why. Because I, because, but my, because my understanding is that Microsoft's operating system is like insane. Like as far as like a GUI that's been tested, like that's just gotten beat forever. That's what Microsoft is, and um, they have. I, I think that they have done a really good job, especially um, if you're trying to control group policy stuff and, and like control local users. So um, I, I feel like that's one of the reasons Microsoft is. The way it is. So I feel like I've talked crap about him. Shouldn't have. Anyways. Um, terrible at talking today. Because I'm talking too much about computers. But if you understand computers. You might go. Oh it's really easy to log in my router. All I have to do is look at my router. And see what it, see what its name is. And then type in the IP address. And then. I'm not going to. I don't know. You can do ifconfig also. But. Um, but it's, it's really easy just to go. Like Google it. Netgear Nighthawk router login and it will tell you the login and then the moment you log in you change the password and then no one else can log in without your password unless they can beat you which some of them can like some of them but it's it really but it it's way easier if they have your password that's why you don't even have to want to save it in your cache you should plug in to the router literally because I think that's what they've done now but I don't think that's what they did I think I think what happened is they 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 might be kicked out already because I disabled so much stuff. 